Okay, so here we're told that 4 to the third power times 8 squared equals 2 to some power, some power x. So we're trying to find the exponent here. And what's nice about this problem is you might notice right away that 4 to the third and, and 8 squared are both 64. So essentially we have 64 times 64. But don't even evaluate that. Think of that as 64 squared. Because now we're dealing with 64, which is a power of 2. And we're dealing with powers of 2, so we can break this problem down. Um, how can we do that? Well, we know that 2 to the 3rd is 8, right? 2 times 2 times 2 is 8. 2 to the 4th is 16. 2 to the 5th is, we keep multiplying by 2, 32. And then 2 to the 6th is 64. So there's the connection. So I can rewrite this. So instead of 64, let's write 2 to the 6th. And then we're squaring that. So all I did there was just rewrite what we already have. So really we have 2 to the 6 squared. Using our laws of exponents, we multiply these two exponents and get our answer. 2 to the 12th power, right? Because, sorry, this, this is not working well. <laughs> so 2 to the 6 squared is really just 2 to the 12th. We multiply those two exponents, and here the answer is A, 12. So x is 12. Thanks.